PFF graders, grading the PFF graders, doing it a little different this week. Like always, changing it up. J, Bull, G, Tyvis, I'll give you a grade. I will give you the player. And then I will ask you guys to decide where that ranks for them this season oh, or wow. in their career, depending on how long they've played for the Browns. So we're going to see this so game. And you're going to tell me the season, their eye test. The is season. this their third best game, their fifth best? I'll okay. give you multiple choice. All right. So let's start with Deshaun Watson. He graded out, according to PFF, at a 59.9 mm. versus the Ravens. Wow, that's terrible. In his career for the Browns, <laughs> because he only played five, five, six real games this season. In his yeah. career for the Browns, is this his second best PFF grade he's received, his fourth best, or his sixth best? I think his second best. Fourth. Second. So we have a second? Uh, PFF, I love fourth. PFF. They've heard. <clears throat> I feel like they, I've lost credibility. Well, remember seconds, what I said a couple four. weeks ago. They're you dead join out the dead <laughs> <laughs> train. I, I mean, I don't understand 59-9. I, I, I don't either. He that's, had a me, terrible first half. Okay, but he was 14-14 to 14 in the second half and made several plays that without, they don't win the game. He also they don't got, get any bigger than he that. He also had one touchdown and one pick. Well, his numbers weren't gaudy. I'll give you that. Yeah. <laughs> All right, so what are you talking about? But, uh, but the eye test, Ty. The <laughs> eye test. Second, fourth, or sixth are your options. We, it's two seconds, two fourths. They said second, me and I, I got four. Yeah. Two got seconds, two fourths, zero correct answers. It was his sixth highest graded game wow. as a member of the Browns. Wow. His second highest was the Tennessee game, a 74.6. Is the Brown better than this one? No. His fourth highest against Cincinnati, week one, a 66.8. Washington this, last year. Week six, yeah. Oh, that that was. Uh, I'm so I thought you okay. said just this year. That no, no, I said for his but, Browns career because he only played six. Uh, there's no way so. he played better in the Bengals game than he did yesterday. Not a chance. No, no. not a no. chance. That's Hell, ridiculous. his numbers in that game were horrible. <laughs> yeah, was, the field was soaked. Yeah. The ball was wet. Yeah, I don't. I don't it was like get ten it. of nineteen. Yeah. If, if I'm not mistaken, like that's what that's what drives me nuts with yeah. the FF. Like, just look at the. It's Watch crazy. the game. They're dead to me. <laughs> They're dead to me. All right, next up, Amari Cooper, who graded out at a very high 75.5 on Sunday. Amari Cooper, one of his better games. Is that his second best game of the season? This is, this is just for Amari this season. Second best game of the season, fourth best game of the season, or seventh best game of the season for Amari Cooper? Two, four, or seven <laughs> for number two. I'm double down and on four. I'm yep. saying four. I'm saying four, four, four too. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Fours across the board. Last time, no correct answers. This time, yep. y'all nailed it. Got his out. second best game was Seattle, <laughs> a 78.8. This week, his fourth best, 75.5. His seventh best, a 70.3. Almost every game this season, Amari Cooper has been between a 70 and a 79, which is about – it's a pretty damn good grade for us. And he got an option after this season, right? There's no, there's Boy, no, they, it's not, there's no option. It's just they could pick, they could get out of his contract. If they ain't, want. ain't nobody getting you out of none of that. You know, you can't. Can't. Yeah, yeah, that ain't happening. They have It's their failure to draft and develop. Right. That's on them. Has right. led to the fact they're gonna have to pay him whatever they have to pay him. And and you know, I, I'm still. This the last that's year. That's still my I, biggest concern about them this season. Yes. You yeah. gotta have more than one wide receiver. You can <laughs> do it. It's a what fact. What you mean? My, you, you didn't see my boy in the end zone. Who? Number eight. That eight ball. You ain't see him in there? <laughs> Didn't I tell you, America? It was coming soon. Now, it ain't no big breakout game, but he finally broke the streak of just Amari Cooper being the only one. Deshaun Watson spoon fed him. That's that fine. Ball. We'll no, take it any way like we can get it. With a big we'll beard, take it any way we yeah, can get it. Go. Here's a touchdown. <laughs> Here's a touchdown. That's fine. Here you go. Here you go That's bro. fine. We can't hear that god awful stuff. They're going to need Amari Cooper's the only one, the only wide receiver with a touchdown. And McNuggets stats be proving it. Hey, Tillman be on the field all the time. <laughs> Tillman, Tillman get the most snaps, and I don't see him. Does he, he really? He, bro, he yeah, be he on the field all snaps. the time. You just never he see him. I guess he's not, a good blocker. He is blocker. not recognizable out there. He gets there. zero separation. You can't, wait a minute. You can't say that he's not rec. What was the, the rushing yards for the what, – what did we finish with? 170 against Baltimore? He that doing, is correct. He doing yeah. something? That wasn't him. Against, what do you mean that's against, not him? Against the Cardinals, he was Olay at people. Ole, <laughs> no, Olay, Olay, Olay. Amari Olay. Cooper Olay somebody. But that's Amari And I couldn't believe he's it. Allowed he's allowed to do that. No, he ain't he allowed he to do that. He gets two Olays a game if Listen, he wants. I, one thing <laughs> I about – I agree with that. Write that in his contract. Wait a minute. Take one thing, carefully. One thing about the game of football – you can never, ever put on tape 
that you didn't want no parts. It just looks bad. Like, it, cause it's obvious. Like you didn't want to do it. Like you should never, his hands, even if you don't want to do it, you go in there. His hands are do valuable. It. We are not getting those things it. crushed. You put a shoulder. Touching other people. This is the thing. It, it was a crack back. You can't even crack back. All you got to do is just jump in the way. Just it's like a pick in basketball. Now we've now, he can't do a pick in basketball. We've now put, he doesn't want to. We, Y'all are sick. We, we, <laughs> these, there's cats that earn that during the season. Like Miles Garrett do whatever he want. He could he could dump out his plate. Take this dinosaur and sit Indian style under a during the play. Wants. This is they, okay. Give us the ah. next player. They lost their mind. Next up is <laughs> Jerron Christian. So I'm going to show you his grade and I'm going to ask you to see where this ranks among Brown's left tackles this season. He <laughs> played one grade, it's only, one yeah, game. It's the only game he's played. So this is among all Brown's left tackles this season. He graded out ah, a 69.6. Really That's very good. Number I thought first. He, hey, they didn't call his name <laughs> all the whole game. <laughs> so so he, he did give up the, the, the hit that led to the fumble. Yes, he did. All right, is this a multiple? Poor choice answer? Yes. Okay. First, second, or third? Is it Se- the highest, second. the second highest, or the third highest? It's grade? not the highest. A left I, tackle. Know, I know someone's had it in the 70s. That a left, left tackle. tackle. This is just left oh, tackle. Just at left tackle. What are the options? This one, see, this one two, or three. One, you two, know or what? three. That might be one. number one. Number that one. That might be number you one. Say, I'm going two. You said this season. A Browns left tackle this season. Yeah. Is that I the think highest that, grade a Browns left tackle this season has put up? Wait one, a minute. Two, has somebody played outside of I don't of remember Jed? Jed Wills getting a number one, getting a, a 70s. I ain't seen no 70s, bro. But I do yeah, remember yeah, DeJuan Jones had a 70s. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Wait, tackles. this is, this is I know, right? Oh, this is, that's what I'm saying. As, as tackles go, It no, might be one. I think it is <laughs> think number it one. Hold on, wait. I got two. Ones? Wait a minute. No, no wait a minute. Tyvis? I'm going to be with Bull. Bull might know something. It's one or two. It's so one or two. that is half the panel for Bull one, half PFL. the panel for two. <laughs> JG, I regret to inform you that you are right. It is the highest grade. <laughs> grade <laughs> for <laughs> a left tackle. I, 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 you I, I, don't know Ryan. Jed Wills, American Idol. You are definitely Not moving on. Yeah. <laughs> Jed Wills against San Francisco had a 69. So very close, but Christian edged him out by point six. Yeah, you, His my, second my, best grade that's crazy. in Go week ahead, nine nuts. against Arizona, a 66.4. By the way, a little, little stat for you. The rushing yards the Browns had against the Ravens was the second most rushing yards the Browns have allowed, uh, the Ravens have allowed in their last 57 games. Without Nick Chubb. That's nuts. And let me, Only and the Steelers last year rushed for more yards. And we were ready to, uh, like, <laughs> we were all <laughs> done with Ford. Jerome Ford. We were all done with him. We, we wanted his team. carries to go to strong. You, you know what? We really have to give credit to Kevin Stefanski. Did was, you guys uh, do that yesterday? I was, I was yeah, just going to say. Because he needs flowers for the, what he the, did. I've been there. saying it on the postgame show for the past, since the bye week. No, well, they, you have to on that. You're a Browns employee. That's not true. But I no, but I, <laughs> stop that. You better cut that out. You better cut that out. We were being critical of the Browns and you said, <laughs> uh, uh, dear Cleveland Browns, you know, the ones that pay my other paycheck. All of this criticism is Wait not sponsored by me. That's not true. Yeah, I am allowed to be. The thing about me is this. Sorry, right, listen. America, 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 hey, when no, your hand go up like that, America, either, you know, you've been caught cheating. America. Man, hold on, hold on. Wait a minute. Hold on, hold on, baby. Baby, please. Baby, please. Let me, let baby, talk, please. Let me talk to the world. Is this the camera? Okay, listen. One thing about me, whether good, bad, or indifferent, <laughs> I'm all I'm yep. always tell it like it is, no matter yeah. what. Now, and at the very least, the, he could have been neutral. You didn't have to give him flowers. The word, True. my choice of words, might be different. Yeah, <laughs> but I'm gonna still tell it like it is. I mean, you gonna know where I stand by the end of it. And and Kevin Stefanski's done a great don't job. Don't ever let go of that. Yeah, because without that, you have no credibility. You that have to be true. critical when the situation calls for you to be critical, mm-hmm. and you have to give flowers when they are warned. And, and, and they made, I, I, yesterday I came with the flowers, bro. Like if you if you was to tell me, you have to give credit to say, I've had a backup dude that was basically off the streets. Yes, he played better than our starter that's been here for Bill five Callahan. years. Bill Callahan, they, they yeah. clap it up. Off to you again. Yeah, now, none stop of us, Mitchell. Stop Mitchell, yeah. guys. None of us knew who the left tackle was, although he has played in the league. He is a veteran. <laughs> I, I well, mean, you could have told me that his name was I, uh, Jeff Walker. Right. I wouldn't have been able to. Uh, no, I didn't, I had never heard of him. Before I had, last week. and he gives us the highest grade uh, of a left uh, tackle uh, in the think, <laughs> all year. And think about this. Think Jed, about you're in trouble, bro. The, the level, <laughs> the level of professionalism that he gave. Was he a third he, round pick? He came in here and gave him. He came in here and was blocking his tail off against a rival. 
The, yeah. he, he didn't sign up for this. You on the road. Playing. It wasn't like the Cardinals. No. I mean, this was a good right. you know, On you got, the road, you can't hear any signal. You, you got also got to give credit to the guards. I mean, yes. tell, oh, Teller man. and Batonio have been doing this. They played great. I mean, the, the, the right tackle, yeah. like Teller, he been having a rotation at right, right tackle yeah, this that, season. Teller, and they've all been made, playing really well. He made a few well. hits, uh, oh. a few blocks Sunday was, yeah. Yeah. that are going to be the front end of his bio tape. Teller but he, but yeah. both of them, has to. they had to communicate all game, letting them know, hey, this is yep. what you got. Now, I'm going to let you, this is what you got. Good. Ooh, <laughs> <laughs> That's Ooh. clean up duty. No white teeth. <laughs> Look at that. And Deshaun Watson, mm. you watch Deshaun Wyatt Teller, he sees it's coming. Can you play it one more time? <laughs> Wyatt Teller says he's, you can see it. Watch, watch him look. Yeah, I didn't use it. Right in the beginning. Watch him. He's looking over. He sees it. Oh, now I'm going to get him. <laughs> he, said, <laughs> he said, watch it. Watch it. It's like a kid. With I'm going to get you. I'm going to get you. Here we go. He said, send him back inside. Ooh. Hey, Ooh. Wyatt Teller, listen, when Brian Bulaga spot shadow you after the game, you know you was balling. Yeah, that's, that's just true. that's it. If you he got Brian Bollinger, Bo- yeah. Brian Bollinger. Yeah, let's see. Bolaga yeah. was an offensive yeah. line too for yeah. the Packers. He was. I, yeah. I liked him. For, good, good, good. All right, who's next? Let's audience. go to the defensive side of the ball with Miles Garrett. He graded out a 68.9. What? This season. <laughs> dead to me. This season. Is that BFF his? BFF is dead to me. Is that his fifth highest grade? They've played nine games. The eighth highest grade. Or his lowest grade of the season. I bet it's his so lowest. lowest, second lowest. I'm gonna say fourth, eight. eight. I'm gonna say eight also. Eight. He had one. one he had one that was like 65. You know what? I, I do remember one time he had one that was so low that we were like, we that's like trash. That's, yeah, come that's on. Trash. Now, so maybe it is the second lowest. And it is the second lowest. His first lowest was Week Four against Baltimore, a 63.7. This time, a 68.9. His second lowest of the season. Dead but that me. game, he did nothing. That was like the only game all year he yeah. did nothing. They, the whole team did nothing. I mean, in that game. I was no, begging no him on Twitter for back-to-back sacks, and he gave them to me. I mean, like I was like, we need this. Come on. Gee, his pass rush grade on Twitter. Yeah, on Twitter. His pass rush game, and this was high. His run defensive grade was very low. And I just thought, I didn't think of this till right now. The Keaton Mitchell long touchdown run. Was a draw where they drew him off the field and ran right through that hole. And I'm, <coughs> I'm curious if stuff like that is yeah. what dropped I blame, You guys weren't here. So how about the speed that kid showed on that run? Oh, my God. That and how dumb fast. was Harbaugh for not getting the ball again? I couldn't figure out why they weren't going to him more. Four touches. Hey, listen. That play bothered me. Was he hurt? No. To, that ball. play bothered me so much. Well, anytime from a, from, the team breaks off a long run on from you. From a defensive standpoint, because – to, the size of a defense is three things. It's tackling, leveraging, and, and eliminating explosive plays. And in one play, all three of those was broken. And, and Dale Pitt, I don't know what you was doing. Just go shoot the just, outside leg and make him cut it Grant back. I don't know Dale why Ray, you he just, stopped. He, Grant Dale Pitt he did blow it, but and, I'm, I got to be critical. As a Browns guy, I got to still be critical. Bro, go shoot your shot on the outside leg. They Even were, if you miss, you'll yeah. stop him, and they'll slow him down. And I everybody don't think they get realize they just let how him go. quick that guy was. I don't yeah, think, I think that's exactly I what did. it is. I, I, my God. I was <laughs> like, this guy Nobody checked the scout report. Mark Emerson, Mark em- these two were unblocked. Harbaugh said after the game, I, yeah, I might have to play him more against Cincinnati. Oh, you think? Wow. And, and, Three and, carries. And talk, and talk about this. About This is why yeah. the, this is why the Baltimore <laughs> Ravens, it, it, it's hard to call them true contenders. Because Baltimore has lapses where it, they can look so good throwing the football. Lamar Jackson can look unblockable. They got great guys on the defensive end, but they just go through lapses where they you get what, no though? points. I, or you say right. that about every You're team. right. Yeah, you're, you're right. But let's look yeah. at their three losses, guys. Yeah. Against the Colts, they had a rare Justin Tucker missed field goal that right. won it in regulation. Yeah. Then they had chances to win it in overtime, and they couldn't close that deal. The Browns game, I mean, let's face it. They played well sure. enough to win for the most part. They didn't win, and the other loss was to Pittsburgh. And they gave it away. In and the they second gave half. that game yeah. away. They so gave, I mean, yeah, yeah. yeah, they're seven and three, but they're seven and three with an arrow going up in and, my book. And again, I don't want to diminish my opponent because it diminishes what I accomplished when I diminish my opponent. The Ravens are an excellent team. Very good team. They're very good on both on all three phases. Did they of the lose game. to Pittsburgh and Baltimore too? I don't remember where that game because was. Because I know Indy and Cleveland. Those two losses were at home. Yeah. My son was at the game yesterday. He went with two of his cousins. Yeah. Um, a group of six people went. And Corey said, at the end of the game, Browns fans were taking that place over. He said it was the, yeah. a, a really good crowd, a good showing of Browns fans. Not a surprise. And he, I, I should throw this out there. He said he's been to a lot of opposing stadiums. He said Brown, uh, Ravens fans, even after the game was over, could not have been more cordial. 
just thought really? I'd throw that out there. That's nice. Yeah. We got one more before I got a crazy stat for you guys. I'm going to bring in Mary Kay with an update on Deshaun's ankle oh, and good. everything else. Good. Greg Newsom, his first career pick. Time is shout out to your guy. He had graded out at a 79.6. Is that his highest grade of the season, his second highest grade of the season, or his third highest grade of the season? Highest. I don't remember him being in the 80s. Highest. No, I'm going to go highest. I, I'm going to say highest. Everyone says highest. The second. answer. No, G says second. second. G. Oh, we have a correct person then. G, you got wow. this right by 0.1 points. Yeah, because I, I don't remember him being in the 80s. Week That's one against point. Cincinnati, he had a 79.7 grade. That's funny. This week, a 79.6. <laughs> All right. And then uh, right after, 77. 